Glad to be here. I'm David Josephson from Josephson Engineering in uh, Santa Cruz, California. We're a small manufacturer of microphones, um, specialized microphones for uh, music recording of, of all kinds. Uh, Christophe from uh, Audio Addict has uh, invited us to uh, join the Audio Days um, uh, presentation, celebration, whatever we call it here in, in Paris. And um, I'm happy to, to be here and, and uh, describe some of the microphones that we make uh, for you. Um, Josephson Engineering has been around for uh, almost a little over 20 years now. Um, we're three uh, engineers, a, um, an acoustical engineer, an electronic engineer, that's me, and a manufacturing engineer. We have uh, altogether six people in Santa Cruz making microphones now. Um, we do the uh, design, manufacturing, uh, all of the metal work and so on right in our uh, facility there in California. Um, we also do some microphone work for other, um, uh, other companies. We manufacture capsules and so on. Um, it's always our interest to sort of push the edge of what is possible in, um, in microphone design and construction, try to do things that other people um, haven't been able to do. Uh, so we're not making general purpose things, but um, trying to make something special each time. One of the first microphones that we made that is um, of that sort is the C700. This is the C700A, which is the basic mono version. Uh, we were thinking about how to make a microphone that had a, an adjustable directional pattern uh, where you adjust the pattern after the recording, rather than just um, uh, selecting a cardioid or hypercardioid or whatever. Uh, if you record the pressure sig component of the signal and the pressure gradient component of the signal separately, here is two outputs in the cable, one is pressure, one is pressure gradient, then you can decide what sort of directional pattern you want after the recording, and that's the, the basic concept here. The most powerful version of that um, uh, technique is the 700S, which is the same as this microphone with a an additional capsule, a third capsule that faces sideways. And if you're familiar with MS recording, you can recognize that you generate the M signal from the Omni and figure eight capsules in the front. Typically half of Omni and half of figure eight gives you a cardioid. Uh, and then the S signal is generated from the side facing capsule. So any kind of uh, stereo or surround recording can be um, made uh, with these three signals. The W, that's the Omni, the X, that's the front-facing figure eight. The Y, that's the side-facing figure eight. Um, by adjusting the ratios, you get different patterns. By adjusting the phase, you can adjust uh, whether the patterns are facing toward the front of the mic or the back of the mic. Um, we also have a, uh, a fairly general purpose cardioid microphone that's not here, I guess Christoph must have sold the last one. Uh, that's the C42, it's very popular. Um, there are stereo matched pairs and single ones. We also make a uh, uh, single cardioid microphone that's intended for very close up high sound level applications. That's the E22S microphone which is um, similar to the, C20, the C42, but with a, a different design capsule specifically for high sound pressure levels and also use very close to the sound source. We don't want the directional pattern to uh, change with distance. We don't want the uh, timbre of the pickup to change with distance. And the E22S is a microphone that is uh, optimized for that sort of a close-in uh, uh, recording. Um, then we have a what we consider to be a reference standard omnidirectional microphone. All of our microphones are condenser types that are powered by standard 48-volt uh, phantom power. Uh, this one is also 48-volt phantom power, but it generates a 200 volts for the microphone capsule. Well, the other capsules are uh, plastic diaphragm, uh, condenser types uh, that operate on 45 volts. 
These are instrumentation capsules from Mikrotech Gefell that operate at 200 volts, which is necessary for the, the best performance. We consider that's um, pretty much the best um, um, omnidirectional microphone that can be made today, and that's why we, this is the one capsule that we actually buy from someone else. So, the 700, 700S, uh, E22S, the 617 um, uh, Omnis are um, represented here. There are two new models uh, that are not here. One is the C715, which is adjustable Omni and cardioid. It is a large single diaphragm microphone. The capsule is somewhat similar uh, to the Sony C37 capsule with a, a mechanically adjustable uh, pattern uh, where you close a shutter in the back of the microphone to switch between uh, cardioid and omni. Uh, we also have the 716, which is a capsule similar to this one. In this microphone, it's in um, figure eight mode. In the 716, it's cardioid only. It's optimized for cardioid. These two microphones, the 715 and 716, uh, are the result of some research that we've been doing for many years on the effect of reflections, acoustic reflections inside the microphone basket, which can cause a problem. Here you can see on the sides of the microphone, there are bars that hold it together. And in every other microphone of this sort, where you have a grill or something like that, there is some structure that causes reflections. The 715 and 716 grill is made of um, hard aluminum foam. It looks like plastic foam, but it's made from aluminum, and it has um, a uniformly distributed, very, very low uh, coefficient of reflection. So many of the high frequency problems that you hear uh, in microphones due to reflections inside the grill uh, are, are, are taken, care, taken care of, removed in that way. So that's the product line. Uh, the 700 series, series seven is uh, all of the various large capsule microphones. The six series are the Omnis and Cardioid, the E22S is in the six series also. And the four series is the uh, lower cost, um, but still we consider uh, excellent um, Cardioid microphone for, for general purpose um, applications, uh, recording in the distance or up close. Um, all of this information is available on uh, on our website, uh, josephson.com, and uh, of course uh, here in France through um, Christophe at, uh, at Audio Addict.